In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Inside Tag from LinkedIn to your website via Google Tag Manager. We are in LinkedIn Campaign Manager, and in order to get to your Inside Tag, you need to click on Analyze. And here you will have Inside Tag, Website Demographics, and Conversion Tracking. So Inside Tag is right here. Just click on it you will get this screen with three different options how to install your tag. You can either install it yourself, so just manually install that on any of your web pages. So by clicking here, you will see uh, this code. You can just copy the code and then paste it to your website directly. You can send the code to your developer or you can use a tag manager and by tag manager, they mean a lot of different tag managers. So there is an option for a Google tag manager right here. They actually provide you with all the information that you need to know in order to install that tag into your Google tag manager yourself. So first of all, you need to have a tag manager. It needs to be installed on your website correctly. And then in order to implement your inside tag, you need to do these steps. We are in the Google Tag Manager. My Google Tag Manager is already connected to my website. If you didn't connect your Google Tag Manager to your website, just look in Google search how to do it. It's pretty easy. There is a plugin for that. Well, it depends what kind of platform are you using for your website. Now you just need to choose tags and create a new tag. The next step is to click on tag configuration. You will see a pencil sign on the right and click here. Let's look for LinkedIn tag. Here it is, LinkedIn Inside Tag 2.0. We're going to choose it. Now we're going to get back to our LinkedIn. We're going to copy our partner ID. We're going to paste this ID right here. And we're going to choose a trigger. Trigger is where we want this tag to fire. It means that if we want to read a data from a specific landing page, we're going to choose that page as a trigger. Or if we want to choose our website, like all the pages on our website, we are going to choose few pages, basically all the pages. So in my triggers, I have a lot of different options. And one of them is all pages. Let me show you, I'm going to add it here. But as I said, if you want to install this tag and you want to track data from a specific page on your website, you can simply add it as a trigger. So instead of all the pages, you're going to choose new tag. And in the new tag, you're going to choose page view. But instead of all the pages, since it's a default option on Google Tag, you're going to click some pages and you're going to choose page URL from, well, this menu right here. You can choose either contains or start with. I like to choose contains because that's that way I'm not going to miss anything. And you're just going to type in your landing page URL and save it in the name of the tag. Just say LinkedIn tag and click save. Thank you for watching. I hope this video was helpful to you. Let me know in the comments below if you still have any questions and I see you in the next one. Goodbye.